few of the uh, today we got to receive the missions that comes from you. Please we will be able to hear the Lord God. So we ask you, Lord God, to see the angels from the heavens, Lord God, to minister we ask, Lord God. To guide us, to help us, Lord. Most of all, Lord God, open our minds, open our hearts, open our ears, open our lips, Lord God. Yes. May we speak for your glory, Lord God. We ask, Lord God, in the name of Jesus, through the Holy Spirit, everybody who listens to you, Lord God, hearken to your words, Lord God, and do them. They will be seen. I pray in Jesus' mighty name through the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. The Father, the Son, Holy Spirit, and please, brothers and sisters, you may sit down. Our reading for the day is in the, um, the book of Luke, chapter 19, verses 1 to 10. At that time, Jesus came to Jericho and intended to pass through, town, through the town. Now a man there named Zacchaeus, who was a chief tax collector, and also a wealthy man, was seeking to see who Jesus was. But he could not see him because of the crowd, for he was short in his nature. So he ran ahead and climbed a sycamore tree in order to see Jesus, who was about to pass that way. When he reached the place, Jesus looked up and said, Zacchaeus, come down quickly, for today I must stay at your house. And he came down quickly and received him with joy. When they all saw this, they began to grumble, saying, He has gone to stay at the house of a sinner. But Zacchaeus stood there and said to the Lord, Behold, half of my possessions, Lord, I shall give to the poor, and I have extorted and if I have extorted anything from anyone, I shall repay it four times over. And Jesus said to him, Today salvation has come to this house, because this man too is a descendant of Abraham. For the Son of Man has come to seek and to save what was lost. This is the word for our salvation. This is glorify God. Praise be you, Lord Amen. Jesus Christ. Jesus, glory to God in the highest. And me, I move this one, this side. First, we will be going to see this other. Yep. Thank you. So, our message of the day is uh, going worldwide. So, nothing is stopping. The word of God has to be preached. Amen? Amen. So, now, um, I'd like to tell you that the Son of Man came to save, to seek and save that which was lost. Amen? Amen. There is nothing in the scripture that says Jesus Christ saved those who are righteous. Okay. It's not. You can't see anything like that. But Jesus Christ came to call all sinners in this world. Amen. Because the righteous, they cannot be saved. Because they don't need Christ. But the sinners, they can be saved because they have forgotten themselves and now they try to recognize their sinfulness and they needed Christ in their lives. Amen? Amen. Beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. So, if a person stands in front of you and says a wrong thing about somebody and is slander somebody that they are that bad people, they are like the rich man. You see, the parable of the rich man said in his prayers, Thanks God, because I am not one of those people like this, like this, like this, and like that, you know? But the poor man, Lazarus said, Oh Lord, I'm pinning his heart. I'm so sorry for my sins. And you know what happened? Lazarus came to the bosom of Abraham. Amen? We are all the children of Abraham. Amen? Amen. Now, if we try to stump one after the other, that we are greater or we are better than them, then we will lose our salvation. It's simple. So today, I will have to teach you something about the stewardship of God. Amen? Amen. Hallelujah. Pray Lord. So, I thank God because, as you can see now, that this message is now in YouTube, right? So you can watch all my preaching in YouTube now. So thanks very much, Lord God, because I prayed last week and straight away God answered it. So all my teaching will be in YouTube, as you can see now. All right, so... I first get put up because God answers prayer. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. But God 
is a God of positive attitude. He answers our prayers. Amen. Especially Amen. people of contrite heart. Amen. Amen. Everybody was called in this world. Yes. And he rejects, he doesn't reject anyone who comes to him. Yes. But Satan always rejects the people who turn to God. Remember that one. He will always slander them, he will always see negative to them. Because that is the mark of Satan. He is a fool. Amen? Amen. So you can see now, be careful of people who uses others. Be careful of the people who are thinking of themselves better than others. You know, be careful of this one. Because it's, it is a pitfall, you know? Self, self is worshiper. Lucifer. <laughs> look, at, look at that one. If Lucifer thinks that he is the best. Now, what happened to him? He lost his post. And now, he is a jobless hero. Amen? Hey. He's like a lord. Jobless hero. <laughs> you know, you know, sometimes uh, I will remember some uh, people saying, uh, let us see who is your God, okay? Let us see who is your God. My God is a good singer. He is a worshiper in heaven like that, okay? Let us see who is better. Your God is Jesus? Okay, let's have a look. Let's have a competition, right? Okay, so <laughs> the people there, the Pharisees, you know, and all that, they said, okay, I will give you a two test." Between the two of you, uh, Lucifer and Jesus Christ. And what is the test? The test was for Lucifer to make or build a website yeah. or like uh, apps to, to be put in the computer. So he's very quick. He knows the computer, everything like that. But uh, unfortunately, my wife doesn't know much about computers. <laughs> <laughs> But anyway, Jesus, <laughs> Jesus wrote, uh, uh, Jesus also wrote some uh, website, you know, and he put some apps in the computer. But uh, they're only very short ones. <laughs> but then uh, Satan was writing a uh, lot of things in the computer, you know. And he was very proud of himself. That he knows and he will beat anyone else. But suddenly, the power broke off. The power came off. And the power of the computer ran out. Oh. And, and uh, Lucifer said, oh my goodness, I lost all my work. <laughs> I lost my word, what's going on so now? But what about you, Jesus Christ? I did lose my word, Jesus said, because Jesus saves. You see that man? Amen. <laughs> if you don't save your work in the computer and there's a power blackout, you will lose your work. But because Jesus saves, everything he done is still in the computer. Amen. 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 So now, my brothers and sisters, he came, okay? He came to save you and me. But please forget being very good at yourselves. Yes. You gotta go down the floor, man. So As I said to my work, <laughs> you can put me anywhere you like to put me. I can sweep the floor and I do the job properly, you know. I can sweep I am not up to your position, but if you want to put me to the personal manager, it's up to you. But that's not a position. <laughs> I don't deserve the position, but you are supposed to be there. But look, look, that is not my after. My after is to be an asset of the company, that's all. Amen. If I can be of good uh, help to other people, that is what I am going to do. But the positions, forget it, give to somebody else. Amen? Amen. Amen. That is a true question. And they, they, they realize, what's, what's wrong with you? Yeah. What's wrong with you? This is a good position, good money, you know? But then I said to them, it's not the position. Then because I did that, I see that to you, then you see Christ in me. That Amen. is the best. Amen. Amen. So we give hand to Lord God. Amen. Okay, so one day there was this guy. His name was Zacchaeus. He is the steward of the government. Yeah. But then uh, he was passing uh, in the in the Jericho in, in one of the town there. Okay? So what happened is uh, he knows that Jesus is going to pass Jericho in that town. And uh, this is Zacchaeus. Zacchaeus, you heard the story of Zacchaeus, right? He was handsome, young guy, a short guy like, like me. Like <laughs> Okay. Okay. You see, you see what happened with Zacchaeus. His desire is not for himself, right? But he's a rich man. He's a tax collector, you know? In these days, tax collector, people hate you, you know? <laughs> okay. But, you know, but... His stature is short, so he said, I want to see Jesus. A person of that stature, a sinner like me, he wants to see Jesus and he wants to receive Jesus with full joy. Amen? Amen. Amen. And what happened with this guy? You know, I should know the story already. Yeah. 
So ears went off, and find a sycamore tree. He said, <laughs> although I'm sure, but I can't, I, can, I can find that tree. Once I'm on top of it, I can see Jesus Christ passing this way. Yeah. Straight away when Jesus Christ passed, just opposite the sycamore tree. Jesus said to him, Zacchaeus, come down. <laughs> How is that? <laughs> Zacchaeus, come down. He was, he was not expecting it, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. He was not yeah. expecting that. It, sometimes in our lives, we become Zacchaeus. <laughs> All right? We become Zacchaeus in our lives. So greedy, so rich. We believe that riches belongs to us. Okay? Being, being a steward, okay, a steward is not the owner. But the manager, amen?